Well, as we head into another football filled weekend, Michigan and Michigan State are back home and the Lions take on the Chicago Bears. Detroit Now's Ronnie Duncan caught up with some veterans today and shares their picks to win in this week's Ronnie's Roundup. They came ready to salute the Stars and Stripes. This edition of Ronnie's Roundup comes from Plymouth, Michigan. Here, this Veterans Day ceremony spotlighted two World War II veterans and both sports fans too and both approaching 100 years old. 97-year-old Navy veteran William New and Army veteran 99-year-old Gene Overholt. I asked them about the Spartans game against Rutgers. Well, I'll tell you, uh, having three daughters that went to Michigan State, I got some money invested there. <laughs> Perhaps money well spent on that side. Michigan State, they're going to have a battle. Uh, I don't know. They might do it. As for the maize and blue, as Michigan gets ready to take on Nebraska, I took that question to Bobby Ziada. Well, the boys are going to have a tough time of it, but if they play like they did last week, they'll do fine. Can the Lions win two games in a row? I'm going to start with you first. I doubt it. <laughs> I, 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 doubt uh, it. I think uh, yes. So we salute two veterans who are nearly 100 years old. And yes, they wanted to be a part of Rowney's Roundup on this day that we salute America's favorite soldiers. And why not? In Plymouth, Ronnie Duncan, Detroit, Now News.